What up, man? You came back. That means you like my videos. That's what's up. That means I like you too, man. So check this out. This video is about glutamine. Now, being a newer, the new kid on the block when it comes to YouTube fitness, um, I've noticed, man, there's a lot of hate going on on supplements, man. And I understand why. But uh, on this channel, like I said, I'm breaking, I'm bringing the frustration out of fitness, breaking this shit down to you real, real simple on that primo science shit. And so today we're going to talk about L-glutamine. Do I believe in glutamine? Yes. Glutamine is one of, if I probably, if I could take two supplements, if I could only take two supplements, it would probably be creatine and glutamine. Glutamine is, uh, is considered a conditionally essential amino acid. What does that mean? Well, basically there's two types, three types of amino acids and glutamine is an amino acid. Um, and L, if there's an L in front of it, it signifies that it's in the free form. So there's essential, non-essential amino acids. What's the difference? Non-essential amino acids, your body creates and produces on its own. So therefore, you don't have to get it through your diet. Essential amino acids, your body does not produce. So you have to get it through your diet. Now, there's one other category called conditionally essential amino acids, which glutamine falls under there, arginine falls under there, and I think one one or two other amino acids fall under that category. What does that mean? That means that the conditions in which you put your body under then make it essential or non-essential for you to take more or less of it. So for example, what does glutamine do, first of all? Well, it does a lot of things. One of the things that um, the L-glutamine's main, main function um, is to promote repair and recovery uh, on damaged tissue, namely muscle tissue if you're a bodybuilder. Um, it prevents muscle wasting and it boosts immunity. Those are its main functions. And in fact, if you guys um, are familiar with Airborne, it's that, uh, that it comes in like pill or little like uh, dissolvable tablets. Basically, uh, and, and a teacher made that. Basically, it's, uh, it's like vitamin C, it's an antioxidant, so you so when you get sick, you can get over it, boost immunity during flu season. I know a lot of kids um, when I was going to college were taking airborne around uh, finals and midterms because they get stressed the hell out and everybody would get sick. One of the what's the main one of the main ingredients in there besides vitamin C is L-glutamine because L-glutamine boosts immunity. It keeps your immune system strong. And to be honest, guys, I've, I've been taking glutamine for such a long time. And I know a lot of it does have to do with my diet and my lifestyle, but guys, I have not, I've probably gotten sick in the last three, four years. I've probably gotten sick like twice and I got over in like a day and I feel like the glutamine has helped me definitely, especially during flu and cold season. If there's a day where I feel kind of down, uh, sluggish or low on energy, um, I feel like the glutamine, as soon as I take the glutamine, it boosts my immune system right back up there. But that's not the main reason why I take it. The main reason why I take it is for its repair and recovery um, capabilities. Okay, so glutamine is the most abundant amino acid in the human body. When it comes to amino acids in muscle tissue, over 60, around 60% 60 of your muscle tissue is made out of glutamine. So a lot of people say, okay, you don't have to take glutamine because you can get it in food. Well, only trace amounts, which is why I supplement with it. And uh, depending on your weight, you want to be taking and, and your activity level and all of that. You want to be taking it in five gram servings, um, anywhere from 10 to 20, even up to 30 grams a day, depending on how, your activity level and depending on your weight. Why do I believe in glutamine so much? I believe in glutamine so much because I work so goddamn hard to build up this muscle tissue. So especially when I am dieting and on a very low carbohydrate diet, I am not taking any chances whatsoever um, to lose even an ounce more muscle tissue than I have to. So I love taking glutamine. I don't do cardio without taking glutamine or some sort of amino acid. I Like I do not. And do I notice a difference? Yes, I notice a huge difference. When you're on low carbs and you're doing uh, cardio two or even three times a day, some of you guys are doing cardio three times a day, you you want to be able to ensure that you're holding on to some muscle tissue. And to me, I've done cardio on low carb diets with and without glutamine, and I notice a huge difference when I do actually take glutamine. So that's why I'm a big believer in glutamine. And it's cheap. You can get like... and. 
you should be getting pharmaceutical grade L glutamine. If you get any other type of glutamine, if it doesn't say pharmaceutical grade on it, chances are you don't know where they sourced it from. And a lot of times, guys, if it's not pharmaceutical grade, they'll, they'll source it from either chicken feathers or human hair or something gross like that. If it's pharmaceutical grade, it's fermented in a laboratory, and that's like the grade that a doctor will use. Doctors give this stuff to trauma patients, to, uh, to patients after surgery to help them heal, repair, and recover. Um, they give it to AIDS patients. They give it to they give it to uh, a variety of patients that suffer like great injuries because it does help the body repair and recover. So um, I definitely believe in glutamine. I take it. Uh, I used to take it in this. Uh, you guys know I take Elite Recoup. It's BCAs and glutamine together. There's two and a half grams of glutamine per serving in this. I'm out of it right now, as you can tell. So I'm trying a new glutamine product. It's uh, by Metabolic Nutrition. It's called TAG. It's a different form of it. It's called Translanoglutamine. Um, and I'm trying it out. So um, this is I pretty much the first time I'm taking glutamine, not in the free form. Um, I like Metabolic Nutrition, the brand. It's actually a real good brand. It's actually uh, <clears throat> formulated. It was founded by a medical doctor. And so I'm trying this out. So I'll let you guys know how this is. In future videos but it's supposed to absorb better but like I said guys you wanted my honest opinion my honest truth about glutamine I'm gonna I'm gonna come out with creatine and you know every other type of supplement that there is out there but that's my honest truth about glutamine I like it I take it I believe in it and shit baby I'm trying to get these gains and I'm trying to I'm trying to maintain this muscle mass that I built up, man, especially when I'm cutting. So if you have any questions, man, inbox me on Facebook. I always link my Facebook below. Until next time, baby, from the black to the top, I'll see you at the gym. Yeah.